Howdy, howdy. This is Blue Otter. Uh, so last time we were able to get our seahorses up. Uh, we're going to resume our day. Um, and this will hopefully get some people to come back to this area. Uh, one thing that I would like is to be able to encourage people to come around this side and over here. What are you complaining about? You weren't the one that was complaining. Um, they probably do need places to get food and drink. Uh, so we will go ahead and add some different uh, places that they can do that. Um, let's go ahead and because I need the space, we're going to open that so we can move the balloons because I want to have that uh, that bench there and we can have our coffee machine and we will have our popcorn machine we could do another uh, popcorn um, we can have another popcorn and uh, Oh, we can have we have the OJ squeezer, um, and then we have uh, the bin that we need to place so that um, trash does not accumulate uh, throughout the aquarium. Um, we can put one. We can put one here in the corner. And one over here that should one in each corner that way you are n you don't have any excuse to litter in um, in my aquarium uh, we're going to also put a popcorn machine here and since we I was not anticipating the uh, orange juice machine we can put that right there uh, as well and let's go ahead and so we have it paused um, and then I think I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna put a whole bunch of uh, data signs for the all the fish and aquariums I'll go through and do that um, so this is saying that we need a little bit more uh, filtration uh, let's go really quickly before we restart this up. Let's do a large double filter right there, and that should be plenty. All right, let's unpause it. I do have a lot of messages to get to. We're going to pick our next fish. Um, let's do the gym tank. That looks good. All right, messages. Zhao is leveled up. We're going to, oh, a lot of memory. Determines which experience is gained in a lesser talk, natural talent for fixing and talking. So let's let's really boost you up for that. Oh, we have a black tip reef. I hear you have plans to bring a black tip reef shark to the aquarium. I do now. I have three in my collection, but unfortunately for me, they will soon outgrow in my private tank. For joy. Uh, I would be happy to donate them to the aquarium, provided you make an exhibit as close to real life as possible. As the name suggests, black tip reef sharks are found near reefs. The tank should have a variety of species and lots of rocks. Build a suitable tank and I'll transplant the sharks to you. Uh, build a tank volume 210, rounded corners, uh, two, 20 rocks, a point value of 250 science, sufficient water quality, sufficient heating. Um, I'll look after your sharks. They're safe in my hands. So if we get three black tip reef sharks. That is awesome. Um, we will look into that in a moment. All right. So my uh, my rays have grown. My John Dory has grown. All these guys have grown. So we're going to delete the growth reports. All right. We have that gift shop opportunity that we're still working on. And Dante uh, would be really probably good at something else. And Jim has leveled up. 
Jim is really good with empathy is his strong and precision, which is excellent good or excellent talent, natural talent for fixing. Uh, we have fixing, feeding, and gift shop would be the things that I would have him on. And so I'm going to have him, I'm going to keep him up with fixing. All right. I have unlocked the toilet. Um, let's see what we have unlocked in tank. Ooh, there's Froyo. Uh, ship in a bottle. T-shirt plush. This would be really good. There, there's Lake Sturgeon plush. Um... Here's a Chicago tank. This could be really good for um, for the reef tip, the black reef tip sharks. Um, so let's do that one. Um, even though I'm pretty sure this is the one that is so sufficient heating. So it is going to be a tropical. Uh, what kinds of aquariums? Because the aquarium that I was instantly thinking of is probably not going to be good enough. Which I was going to do the large tunnel tank, but that doesn't have the curved edges that I need. Uh, and the Belfast tank is just not going to be big enough. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to have this tank to to get it to work, uh, so I can get those reef tips those black reef tip sharks um i think i forget if it's the i think it's the white tip or my fa or one of my favorite sharks um all right so we're gonna put a pin in that one i'm still trying to sell toys but we've also got this will give me another opportunity to have the shark hat sales uh, so then this will again drive uh, more people over here and so I need more filtration um, and this is where it really starts getting tricky and you really start just becoming a huge powerhouse of just nothing but uh, you're just nothing but uh, endless arrays of of, of power pumps um so what we're going to do actually is we are going to we're going to start daisy chaining these so that we can have um a large right so we're going to have this one we're going to connect and then we're going to connect it to that one and i think if i can reach this one and if I can even reach one of these, now suddenly all of these are connected except for these two. Um, and then so what I can do is I can just to make sure that we are having sufficient, I can just run another one there. I could actually put another one here or there. Um, and that's, that's gonna be a lot of power and now I could start to just, now it's just a matter of if I connect any one of these to something, they're all gonna be kind of um, pumped up with additional filtration. Um, okay, so it, it's really the shark hats are what's preventing me from getting that because I believe I'm, I'm regularly getting to the balloon sales I'm regularly getting to the shark hats and I think part of that is just the fact that I really don't have too much in the way of what is available so I think what I might do is I might get a cold water shark uh, for this tank and if I do that, then what I could do is I could actually delete these two and we're going to add instead, we're going to put the shark hats right here and we're going to have a shark hat supply that we will put uh, right here. Um, we're going to actually put them right here. We're going to move the mic over one. And then just to make sure, we're going to actually put another second copper band 
toy display right there. Um, so that that way we've got plenty of copper copper band toy displays. Uh, let's look and see if I need to hire anybody. Uh, yeah, he's cheap. Uh, Emma would be good. That would get us another person to talk. Um, I do have a lot of people that I can get. So like, he's gonna have a lot of, with fixing and talking. Um, that she's gonna be really good with um, fixing and. Although I don't think we've really had, we haven't really had too many problems. Knock on wood, we haven't had any issues with um, breakdown. So this will be a really good one to keep up with some of the extra cleaning tasks. So let's come over here and do some management of some of our new employees. Um, so here we have Migo, we're gonna do, that's fixing all the way. Uh, Dante's really good with all right so Jim Tang so we're gonna pick our next research I believe these are in our rank 10 um, that I had picked out too the red belly seahorse and the copper band butterfly uh, copper band butterfly is a wimp this five requires eight but I think we're going to get the copper band and I'm hoping nothing in here is a bully uh, what is your problem? You did not eat mussels. All right, so we need to make sure that, okay, it looks like he got fed now. Um, okay, so we've got 150. I don't think any one of these uh, you're being fed as we speak. Thrones one through four. Okay, um, and you're 16, yeah, I think, I think we're all good, uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to, um, I don't remember where the, the tang, where that tang is that I just got, uh, here's the gem tang, is a six, has 30, cannot be housed with surgeon fish but we've got another regal tang in there so we're not going to be able to put him in there uh what about this what will you eat anthropods do i have enough room we do have enough room we can put jim tang in there um and look at that we've almost got our our shark tank um, so this would be good for doing a uh, a clownfish exhibit which I don't have I did a clownfish exhibit the other day the, in another episode uh, I was gonna put this he's a wimp he requires at least a two by two area I don't think I have anything that has a two by two area so he is gonna require actually no I do um, what's your what 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 are your issues uh, can you handle you can handle this all right so we can actually put our phantom banana fish right there and we have so this one of the things that I like about the other one um, doesn't like food competitors now I'm looking at it okay but he eats krill and supplements uh, cannot be housed with other species that eats krill. That's the only thing. All right, well, we can do the sunburst. Um, and then I see you want some rocks. We can do rocks. I could do. I could do rocks. Rocks are not an issue. Uh, let's let's actually get you a 
That's a cave. Uh, that is not rocks. Um, I... I'm going to close that. Choose later. Uh, we're going to... Actually, I need to... Because I don't have the space. Uh, we're going to... He wants rocks. So we're going to come over here. And we're going to... Where are... There's my rocks. Okay. Rocks. All right. So I've actually got three fish in there, and that's that's actually pretty cool. Um, and then it'd be cool if I had a seahorse one, a seahorse. Um, all right. So we we've got the copper band. I'm pretty sure we'll be able to have the. Um, the balloons, the balloons will be no problem. Uh, we're gonna do the t-shirts next. Uh, so then it's just a matter of where do I wanna put it? And I think I wanna really start leaning back towards this area. So let's go through first and let's open up this area. Uh, very briefly, we're going to, because we're going to actually have this, and um, let's look and see what I, what size I can get with this tank. Um, even though we will most likely not be able to finish this um, this time. So let's look and see how big can we make it. So that's actually a pretty decent size tank. We're going to put it, uh, we can put it right about here. Um, so that will actually give uh, plenty of space that once I open this up, um, I will need to, we can go ahead and open that. And we're just going to go ahead and do a wall there and we can do a wall there what we can do is we can then move this and move this over here into into this area um all right so one of the things that i would like to do is we're going to have to revamp How we have stuff arranged here uh, so I think what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna pause and this we're going to um, we're just going to get rid of in its entirety um, we are actually going to I think uh yeah i've got the money so we are going to we're just going to sell these we are going to fix this uh, in just a second uh we're going to first move a copper the copper band toys right there um then we're going to because we've got to upgrade our large we're going to do a large pump and we're going to connect it to this tank. We're going to connect it to this far tank. We're going to connect to this tank. And then we're going to connect to this tank. Um, now what we need. Because I don't. What I don't have is I don't have. One that's going to connect from one to another. All right. So what we're going to do first is we're going to get some. Uh, mega. Filtration going. All right. So that is that's good. Uh, once we get. We'll be able to, yeah, we can add another filtration over there. Um, and then 
we're going to do is we're going to actually remove this one and we're going to have a smaller pump that will fit right there. We're going to use that to connect this tank to that tank and that completes the circuit. Now, that's not enough heating, but that's okay because I can put plenty of heat right here. Uh, and that is that still not that that is enough heat. Uh, so I've actually taken that entire bit right there and decreased the need for it. Now what we're going to do is we're going to have to uh, minimize some space. And then this gives me room that then I can have a tunnel tank right here uh, that I could put another another aquarium and that will probably be actually a cold aquarium um, although it might be something else I don't know all right so let's go through we're gonna put to there let's do our quick uh, quick painting of the way um, now let's look and see what I need I need at least 20 rock so first thing let's let's go through and we're going to let's just we're gonna rescape the the room here um and there um all right so we're looking specifically for things that will increase science a point value of science uh, which I'm not sure you're going to get too much with plants, but we are going to need uh, 20 rocks. So we could do small rock with kelp. That would be kind of cool. Um, this is a larger one, so we could do we could do a bubble, a rubble with kelp. Um, I think we might end up i know we don't need plants per se uh, i'm honestly thinking the plant drop off i know that this is going to be expensive um or doing something like a plane with rocks which i believe this came with fresh water uh, the fresh water expansion here's a gaping cave this would be really cool there's another and then there's a pitted column with kelp so we could easily have something like that um, and then um, have a gaping cavern um, which should sufficiently uh, no, I don't know but I still need okay so we might not do The let's do that one instead. Uh, we're going to get rid of that one, which I know is going to um, it's going to jeopardize a lot of the rocks. Um, and then we're going to yeah, we're just going to do a rock drop off with. Uh, we'll have another one about right there so that should that will do be plenty for the rocks now I need a point value of science and I don't think you get science from having because you get ecology you can get um, You can get ecology, you can get prestige, um, you can get a number of different things uh, 
from, but not with, so I could do like a, uh, have a nice little, there. So what we're gonna need to do, uh, and I really wish they would tell me what the, um, what the white tip, we're gonna do the big bellied seahorse. Ooh, and then I got the spiny seahorse. So yeah, I've got two seahorses. Um, I'm looking real quick. I believe that's it. Yeah, we have, hold on, what was that? Okay. Um. So yeah, so we're gonna do this one and then the spiny seahorse. Um, okay, so what I need, uh, all right, Tobias is leveled up. We'll do with fitness, we'll do some fixing. Uh, Slender Seahorse has grown up, awesome. Tiger Tail. I like to click on these just because you could see them grow and it, it's kind of a cool, thing we'll go we'll go and take a, a quick gander through the uh through the seahorse exhibit uh, i always loved seahorses i was always fascinated with the fact that the seahorse and there's our up down upside down jellyfish have grown um god rachel has increased what is empathy feeding yeah we're good um i was always fascinated with the fact that the uh the seahorse is one where the um the male is the one that actually carries the infants the babies um it does not tell i wish it would tell me what what would be good for that because i don't want to put like small fish in here although he's a wimp we're going to put him in there and hopefully he is fine um he does not appear to be having issues um he's just a wimp copper band and butterfly i don't have anything else in there uh, live Meyer shrimp do I have what is what is this is this a Meyer shrimp okay that's so, all right legal deal acquired the contracts are signed all of our gift shop items are now official finding birdie merchandise as a result the aquarium has gained a moderate boost to its base prestige awesome so we are still a ways away from getting um, our our winning conditions. We have roughly about a little under 500 prestige to go. Um, and what are you complaining about? Horse eye jack looks. Of course, the horse eye jack looks stressed. Why is the horse eye jack looking stressed? Um, because you have not been fed. Okay. That seems to be a running issue. And I probably, honestly, need to deal with, um, I probably need to focus on, uh, work zones. Uh, but I'm usually so horrible about remembering what or setting them up to begin with. Um, okay, so we have, uh, we need heat. So now what we can do is any of these, we can actually install heat with. Um, and that should be sufficient. Now we have our t-shirts. 
Um, let's do... Um, Link Surgeon plushies. All right. So with this tank, um, I need 270, or sorry, 250 science points. Uh, so I need to look and see what I have. So here is, um, that's, that's an idea. Um, I could theoretically move my rays from this tank to this tank. Um... They earn ecology. And he doesn't earn enough. Alright, so let's... Let's look and see if I can... Really quickly, if I need to, oh, why, why are you, why are you unhappy? Because you have not been fed. Um, so let's see if we can one. All right, let's see. There we are. So we have our black tip reef shark. Uh, I only needed one of these guys. Uh, but we are going to... One of the things that I wanted to do was I wanted to see... We're going to at least grab... We'll grab both of those in there. Can we make that a priority? Um, and then we can... Yellow Stingray... So we can actually, we can add one of these guys um, to the tank. And did these guys require three? They did not. So let's, let's sell him. And so they will eat, they'll be fed. Um, all right. So now let's go through. Uh, license deal acquired. Okay, so we have a blue spotted ribbon tail ray, which I think I actually might have, I might already have. Uh, yeah, so what we could do is we can just actually, we could actually take him and move him over here. And now we've got the giant octopus. That'll give us something to put over there. Um, okay, so the... Copper Band Butterfly was not a good fit for the humpbacks. Go figure. Um, we can... We're going to replace him because he's... Kind of iconic because we've got those toys. So let's see how he fits in there. Um, of course, he's not going to... He's not going to be too happy. Um... Uh, is that just because he needs... Cannot be housed with other species that eat krill. You don't eat krill. You just... You need more rocks. Okay, we can... We can give you more rocks. That's, that's not an issue. Um... Uh, let's go back here and... You little rocks. Is everyone happy? Nobody. All right. Um, so that is there. Uh, now what we're going to do is we're going to put... Okay, so we took care of him. Uh, Verity has leveled up. Um, let me go through really quickly before we do anything else. All we're going to do is we're going to get these one, two, three black tip reef sharks uh, right in there. And then they need herring. So we're going to add some herring. 
uh, on here. Um, and there we go. They probably need supplements. So we do have a supplement cabinet, but so many of my so many of my animals eat supplements that we're just going to get a second supplement cabinet right there. Uh, but with that, we're actually going, uh, we actually went a little bit longer than I planned on. Uh, but we are going to call it there and we will pick up with adding um, the, our new seahorses in there and completing it out to here. And we should wrap it up uh, here in the next couple of episodes. Thank you for watching.